To start with, um, a person who's at the top of the MJ initiative was enough of a reason. Uh, President um, Ellen Johnson Sirleaf has done so much. She brought transformation to Liberia, a country that was emerging out of conflict. And if you understand the dynamics of conflict, post-conflict build rebuilding is not an easy task, especially with the risk of falling back into that. And what she did in creating a foundation for the continuation of um, democracy in Liberia has been an example. She was also the first elected female president across the continent, which in itself is a huge achievement, given that we haven't quite reached that point of gender parity on the continent. She's wise, she's strong, she's very clear about what it is she wants. And in the process of putting out the information on the initiative, it was quite clear that this was not talk shop, this was not something superficial, this was a genuine desire to groom next generation of female leaders looking from the inside all the way to the outside because we're like we have layers and a lot of the time in looking at leadership women's inner essence is neglected but it's an essential part of what you need to be a great leader to be a good leader in any sense and i believe that that's what stood out for me with regards to what the moj initiative could offer